All right, guys. Well, we are roughly 20 minutes into the stream, and we've got six dollars of support. Now you know how it works. Give me monies. When we hit the support goal, I do a mega pull that basically powers the rest of the stream. Because if I end up getting a good character, it means we can use that character then in the tours, in the special event where they're being used. And tonight is no exception. Tonight, if we pull LA Knight, zombie LA Knight then, we'll actually be able to do some special stuff. But we need you guys to buy in and support. Obviously, we don't want 38 streams to end tonight. 38 streams of a streak of support. We want it to continue. We want to get that going all week long so we can do a fun Katsu Burger goal at the end of the week. So please, guys, consider supporting tonight if you can. All right? And uh, let's get it going. Remember, last sa Sunday night, sadly, we did not hit the goal and there was no pull. And it really sucked. Now, there was a Hail Mary tip at the last minute of someone. And uh, then I hit the goal. But there's no guarantee that's happening tonight. In fact, I don't really see anyone in a tipping mood tonight. So if you're here to support, please consider it. And, uh, you know... Let's get that rolling for now. So thank you, Review Fat USA, for our biggest tip of the night. Now we're up to 10 bucks in support. Guys, the momentum ain't doing so well tonight. I'm just being honest. It's not, you know. Um, okay, now, would you like me to be honest with all of you? I'd like to be honest with you guys. Crap, cock, ass, have I ever sharded my pants? Yes, absolutely, I've sharded my pants. I'm an honest dude, absolutely. I like doing WWE Champions. I find it fun to hang out with you guys and talk like we're doing tonight. But these streams are doing worse and worse if you haven't noticed. We can go in and hit the goal. All right. And if we continue to have nights where it looks like we're just not going to hit the goal and people want other stuff, I'll do other stuff. Listen, I'm currently juggling a ton of games. We could definitely use Champions Nights as nights to do other content. I'm just being honest. You know, I'm okay with these because I like chilling with you. But if I should be playing Sonic instead, if I should be doing Life is Strange, if I should be finishing quiet plays if i should be doing chill streams of a different kind like stardew valley if we should be playing other different games i'll do whatever all right i'll do whatever you want seriously but this has been working for almost two months but now perhaps the momentum has died i'll be honest with you guys i have not looked at the stream at all i'm gonna do it right now i'm gonna guess we have 200 viewers on youtube and 40 viewers on kick let's find out we have 206 viewers on YouTube. That's pretty close. Guys, we're at 32 likes. Let's get that up to 50 likes tonight. I said 40 viewers on kick. We have 38 viewers on kick. I was pretty much dead on, correct? Now, here's the thing. There's nothing wrong with not having giant attendance if it means that people are still enjoying and having a chill time with me. We didn't used to have tons of attendance for Stardew Valley. We didn't have tons of attendance for other games. You know what I'm saying? We didn't. But those audiences were engaged. They liked the content and they supported it. If this is going to be now in, in a week's time, two straight Sunday nights where we're not hitting the goals with champions, I think I'm done with it. I'm just being honest with you. I think I'm done with the game and we should do other shit. And I'm okay with that. Right now I've got Call of Duty going on and people want me to play multiplayer and the campaign and zombies. All right? So... I could easily just say, screw this, and let's do something different. So let's see what happens tonight. If more support chimes up, if we do a mega pull and everything, then I think we'll keep it going. If we don't, if we have another night like last week, I think we're done. And I think we should start doing other stuff instead and mix up the schedule, okay? Which sucks because I went out of my way to play the feud so we could hit League 10 and continue. But you know what they say is that, you know, I, I do you want to know the truth? Here's the deal about this game. This is a fun game to play in your own time. This is a fun game to mess around and relax, right? But is this necessarily a game to be constantly streaming? Is it riveting content? Not really. You know, I think it's good to chill and talk about wrestling with you guys, but I'm not necessarily seeing this as being the most entertaining content that I could be putting up. People wanted to see it because the dumbass, brain dead, mouth jeweler fucking meme from my detractors for the longest time was, oh my God. Phil plays WWE Champions and he spends money on it. Yeah, now I spend w I play WWE Champions and I literally spend money on it every fucking time I play it and no one cares. People show up and like it and support it, right? But now I've been doing it for two months and I'll be honest, I think the hype is dying down. I think there's not that many people who care anymore. They know that I play the game. Like, literally, have you heard anyone talking about me playing mobile games recently? No one, because no one cares. You see what I'm saying? Like, it's all, it's all done with. 
the whole dumb thing of oh hating on Phil for playing it's over. I the way I see it, it's this this issue is dead now, right? Like this is like no one brings it up. Even my detractors don't bring it up anymore because they're so fucking embarrassed. Because they realize how dumb, fucking idiotic they are. I mean, morons just make up new shit now instead. That's completely ludicrous and no one pays attention to, right? So the way I see it, perhaps it's time to move on. But maybe I'm wrong. I mean, I like our knights and champions. I think these are fun. I have a good time when we're playing and we're interacting and talking about wrestling. I have a good time when we're talking about other topics. I, I treat this as my late night chill stream at this point. You know what I'm saying? Let's see what happens tonight. But I'm telling you, if the streak ends tonight, dude, well, I'm done with this game. I mean it, too. Like, if the streak ends tonight, I'm, I'm just not going to play it anymore. Okay. Oh, man. Guys, I hope you're having a good time. Again, if you are, please like the stream. Liking the stream helps for engagement. And if anyone could go above and beyond and support in any other way, I would appreciate that. Uh, really slow night for support, which is not a good sign for this kind of variety game. You know, I'm enjoying myself, but... I'm probably not going to be playing this long term if people don't support the streams, just being honest. Because this will be two weeks in a row that that's happened. You know, it would have ended last week with, if not for that giant Hail Mary tip last minute from someone else. So let's see what happens, right? <clears throat> exactly. Sarah says, all your detractors now just say you're boring and they talk about five-year-old memes or they come up with a ridiculous conspiracy that dies within a day anyway. You're right. It's over. It's over for my detractors. Literally, it's done. Everyone has moved on. Literally, everyone who used to bully me either is becoming the person who's now bullied like RTU or everyone's moved on to guys like RTU. They're done with me. They don't need to, to, to waste time on me anymore with this negative shit. And I'm very happy about this. I'm loving the positivity. I'm loving the fun we're having. I think that the sky is the limit in the future to move forward with positive content now because people are finally off my back. So I'm happy. I really am. I'm superbly happy right now. So, that being said, yeah, maybe we're done with this. I don't know. Let's see how tonight goes. Again, like I said, I mean, guys, we're a half an hour in and 10 bucks in into a $150 goal to do a mega pull. I don't think we're going to do it, right? Kate says, I'm cool with Call of Duty tonight. It's cool. No, I hear you. I, like, I know that right now people want what's hot. This game ain't hot. This game was hot two months ago. And just, oh, my God, DSP's going to play WWE Champions, the game that people gave him shit for all these years. And that's the thing. People are like, whoa, I can't believe he's going to do it, man, with a ballsy individual. I've been doing it for two months. You know what I'm saying? So perhaps that's what it is. What do you guys think? That's actually genuinely good. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? I need feedback. Stop talking about stupid fucking Kanye West bullshit. And let's talk about the game, because I'm going to be pissed off if you start derailing the stream of bullshit. No one cares about fucking Kanye West. <laughs> Honest opinions from the people who are here. You know, we got around roughly 250 people here. What do you guys think about WWE Champions? Is this something you want us to continue every week? Or do you think that it's played out? We're done. Don't even bother with it anymore. You know? And then, and here's the truth. No one better bring it up ever again. Listen, I'm able to play whatever fucking game I want in my private life, period. I can play champions. I can play fucking Dokkan battle. I can do whatever I want. If you like my content, please support it. But enough with this being intrusive into my fucking private life of the things that I do, right? I don't want to hear, oh, I found a secret account that Phil's playing this and that. Go fuck yourself. Fuck you. Really, I'll do whatever I want and you'll like it. Because my business is public. If you like the business, you like the content I put out, you support it. If you don't like the content I put out, you don't have to support it. But it has nothing to do with anyone's business. That's how this even became embroiled in my content to begin with, right? If it's played out, it's played out, and we do other stuff. Seriously. If you guys are bored of this game right now, I'll fucking boot up Call of Duty. If it means if it means you guys are going to be entertained, all right? And if you guys are going to have a good time, and you guys are going to say, hey, I would rather watch you play Call of Duty tonight, and I would support your Call of Duty stream, I would do that right now. I would switch, and we'll play for an hour and a half. We'll do a double poll, one on kick, one on YouTube. And see what people want. Well, I'm happy that you like the champ streams, Jeff. But are you going to support them? Because you're not. Greed is massively strong. We have $10 tonight. Oh, let's take that back. We have $24 now because that tip came in, right? We have $24 in support tonight. We're hitting the goals on every Call of Duty stream. Why, what is going on right now with this stream? Right? If you like it, you got to support it. Again, the whole point of me doing this game is to do the pulls, that's the fun of it. I'm not kidding, we have zombie pulls to do. We're gonna finish those in like 20 minutes. And we have nothing to do anyway, right? 
That's funny. The kick chat wants WWE champions? Really? Then why are there zero subs tonight? We've literally had zero subs on the stream. Literally zero. Zero. Not a single contribution on the kick side. We've had super chats and we've had tips tonight and a membership all on the YouTube side. We've had zero contributions from kick. So what are you talking about? Right? All right, so on kick, here we go. Here's our results. You guys ready? Here's our results on kick. We had 75 people vote. 72% said keep playing WWE. 28% said swap to Black Ops 6. Here's the problem. On kick, we started with 40 people. When I said, hey, everyone, vote on the poll, the viewership went up to 92 instantly. Meaning, 50 fucking trolls came in and voted. <laughs> Guess how many votes there are for keep playing WWE? 54. So basically, four people said keep playing WWE, and most people voted for Black Ops 6. On the YouTube side of things, 322 votes. 67% say keep playing WWE. 33% say swap to Black Ops 6. Here's the problem with 324 votes. We only have 200 viewers. So 130 people came in and erroneously voted towards keep playing WWE champions. If you erase that number of votes, okay, then you basically get just around an even split, okay? And you know what? The people on YouTube actually did support the stream. So both polls skewed by trolls, when you take the troll numbers out, it's very apparent you guys are done with WWE. It's 100% apparent you're done with it. You're bored, correct? But as for now, I think we done, I think, have I proven my point, folks? Here we go. Have I proven my point that I have the right to play whatever the hell I want? I can play any game on here I want, and it's fine. I can spend money on whatever I want, and it's fine. Now, admittedly, years ago, when I was in a bad financial situation and going through a bankruptcy, and I was playing this game and spending money on it, that was uh, awful decision-making, right? But things have changed. Things have turned around for the better. And I don't have that weight on my back anymore. I'm not making the bad decisions anymore. So to all the people, all those detractors who tried to make my life a living hell, you can go fuck yourselves. I just proved over the last two months that no one gives a shit about you and the fucking bullshit that you've said about me. No one cares but losers. Oh, here we go again. Seriously, I've had enough of this. <sighs> I've had enough of these fuckheads. Stupid fucking trolls, man. All right. So, guys, here's what we're going to do. We're going to swap over for about an hour. We're going to play some Call of Duty online. I'm down with that, my friends. 100% I'm down for that. Let's do it. In reality, the only people who say stupid shit like that are jealous idiots. You know? Right now, I've had incredible, overwhelming positivity and success in the last month and month and a half of my life. And people are so butthurt about it. They are so angry and butthurt. People who don't like me right now are probably typing away at their computers. I can't believe it. He reached another desk girl. How can he do that? Listen to how he answers this question. And my butt hurts so bad. And they do it every single fucking day because they're losers. And they come on the streams and they try to derail, you know, and tough shit. 